Hello everyone, you will surprise to know that all the living and non-living things or substances on the earth and even in the universe is made up of matter. Now you will ask me what is matter? Not to worry, I will tell you. So this is Neha here and welcome to Aditya Kids Education. Today we are going to learn about matter okay so first of all what is matter matter is anything that occupies space and has a weight okay it can be anything which has weight and it occupies space okay now for example plants air water, soil, metal, wood, plastic, etc. All these are the example of a matter. And one important thing is that matter is made up of molecules. Okay, matter is made up of molecules. Okay. Matter can exist in three main states and they are solid, liquid and gas. Let's have a look on them one by one. Solids. Solids are hard, rigid. Here, rigid means unable to bend. Solids are hard, rigid. Here, rigid means unable to bend or we have to apply a force to change its shape. So, a solid are hard, rigid and has a definite shape and volume. Like stones, a ball, your books, pencils, bed, table, chair, etc. Okay children, do you know why solid objects have definite shape and volume? Why they are hard or rigid? Do you know? Okay, I will tell you. Listen carefully. All this because of molecules. I told you earlier that all the matter are made up of molecules. In solid, the force of attraction between the molecules are very strong. And this force hold the particles or molecules together. And there is no space between the molecules to move here and there. And because of this, solid cannot flow. Okay? As you can see in the picture, there is a picture of a brick which is solid. And as you can see, there are also molecules which are tightly packed. In solids, the molecules are very close to each other as you can see in the picture. Next is liquid. A liquid has definite volume but no definite shape. They take a shape of container in which they are poured, like water, juice, milk, etc. In liquid, there are spaces between the molecules and the force of attraction between the molecules is also not so much strong as compared to solid. And because of this, molecules are free to move and they allow liquid to flow and it takes the shape of the container they are put in. Okay? Next is in liquid. The molecules are less tightly packed. Next is gas. A gas has no definite shape or volume. The force of attraction between molecules are very weak and because of this the molecules move quickly 
in all direction and fill all available space. As you can see in the picture, these are the molecules in the gas. There are large spaces between molecules as you can see. Okay, let's see some examples of gases like oxygen, carbon dioxide, hydrogen, helium, etc. Helium is the gas which is filled in balloons. Okay children, I hope you enjoyed this video. In the next upcoming video, we will learn more about molecules. Till then, stay safe and stay tuned with my channel. Okay, bye.